How's it going champs? We're playing Animal Revolt Battle Simulator and we've got a brand new update just in time for Christmas. Okay, we've got some sharks, piranhas, salmon, that one's floating higher than the other ones, I don't know why. Killer whale, up against, we've got some pigs, tigers, elephants and rhinos. How are they still alive underwater? I don't know. But let's go champs! Oh, it's on. Oh, this is good. <laughs> Shark's just gone in there and just taking a chunk out of the rhino. That's awesome. All right, keep going dudes. Oh, yeah, this is good. This is really good. This is the underwater battle everyone's been wanting to see. I'm loving it. Uh, who's winning at the moment? Hang on. Let's just have a quick look over here. We've got a piranha that's upside down. Okay, that's probably a pretty bad move. I reckon all these animals have about 30 seconds until they suffocate. That's fine. Or drown. Maybe they're gonna drown. <laughs> Oh, that elephant just got launched all the way over there. Man, that killer whale, he is tough. He is seriously tough. Get in there. Yep, bite him. Bite that uh, That elephant. It's not going to live. I'm trying to make these teams cost about the same. 475. Let's put some of these bold billies down. These guys are cheap. Oh, yeah, these guys have guns. Oh, man, I've got some mods installed. And it's causing it to glitch out a little bit. Okay, 480 bucks. Let's go. Humans versus underwater sea life. Let's go. Oh, man. That was crazy. What happened to all those dudes? Oh, the humans won. The humans won. It must be because they had guns. So at the moment, I'm currently using as a mods on Animal Revolt Battle Simulator. It allows you to remove the unit scaling so you can make the units super big. You can also overlap units and it also unlocks maps. This little mod tool here allows you to run mods on like a bunch of different games. There's Deer Simulator, People Playground, Raft, and then like a whole stack of stuff that I don't even have installed. Okay, the same fish team up against some fist units. We've got Handyman, the Crumble over here, and we've got Sir Punchy. So Punchy, we've got Punchy. His name's Punchy. I know his name. Alrighty, dudes, let's go. Let's see how the fist army goes up against all these fish. Oh, they, there's blood everywhere. This is brutal. Whoa, the killer whale, it's down. Who's winning? Yes, fist army has won. They're a tough team, man. I'm not going to lie. They're really tough. So people have been making underwater creatures for quite a while. Have a look at this axolotl though. He's basically like a repurposed lizard. Let's put this axolotl up against a king crab. And see how- oh my god. The crab is actually an ant. Alright, let's go champs. Let's battle it out. Oh yeah, this is good. This is good. It's axolotl versus king crab. Oh, the king crab has won. Let's make a team of these guys. Oh yeah, that's better. Yeah, take that king crab, you jerk. How dare you kill the axolotl, the, one of the cutest creatures in the universe, who can only look up because his face is a disc. All right, let's just make a stack of piranhas. That's the good thing about the Azimods, is you can just go ahead and spawn a stack in like one location. There's like 102 piranhas right there. One person up against 100 piranhas. Let's go. Oh yeah, they're coming to get you, dude. That is bad. This guy is about to have a bad time. He's got all these muscles up here. And then itty bitty pants. All right, he's about to be bit in a very bad place. Oh, ow, ow, that's gonna hurt. That's gonna hurt, they're chewing his face. Oh yeah, they are. You can see his health going down. Look at all those health bars. That's a lot of health bars. <laughs> There's just an underwater cloud of blood. Oh, no way. I can't see what's going on. It is very red at the moment, very red. This man, there's like one on his ear. Look at that! It's biting his ear. That one is biting his hair. He doesn't really have any hair, but it's biting him anyway. It's biting his- what's the stuff under your hair? Scalp! It's biting his scalp. There is so much of this guy to go around for everybody. He's got so many muscles, lots of flesh. The piranhas must be loving it. It's like an all-you-can-eat buffet. And that's a double joke because the guy is super buff. He's just eye to eye with that piranha. There's a couple of dead fish on the ground. He's, he's getting a couple of them. Oh, he almost dead though. That guy has lost a lot of blood. Ah! Oh. I love how they stopped eating him after he died. <laughs> Piranhas are so savage, they only eat things that are living. Okay, let's try those 100 piranhas up against my latest crazy creation, Gravity Man. Alrighty, Gravity Man. Let's go, champ. 
You beat them piranhas. Oh, yeah, he's zapping them. He is zapping them. This guy is actually really good at fighting piranhas. Look at that. I don't, are they trying to bite his metal? I don't think they are. I think they're just going for the fist part of him. Oh, this is good. This is really good. Yeah, punch him, champ. How much health has he got? I can't see which health bar is his. There's too many health bars. I think he's still alive. Yeah, Gravity Man. The ultimate piranha killing machine. Lightning is good against fish because water conducts electricity. Yeah, well done, champ. This is eight poo apes. I call them poo apes because they've got giant bombs and they throw actual poo. Let's go. Poo apes. Yeah, you throw that poo at that piranha. Yeah, do it, champ. You throw it real good. Oh, those, those, uh, yeah, they're just getting smashed. They're just getting, come on, throw some more poo. Do it. Do it. Oh, they got you, champ. Come on, you can do it. <laughs> Look how he ate the poo from his hand. What even is this game? Oh, so someone has already made a Megalodon unit. Look at this thing. It's cool. It's giant. It's massive. Does it even work though? I don't know, because it looks like it's actually scaled up. Let's put some ants down here and see if it can actually swim. Does this shark swim? Yeah, it sort of does. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I'm gonna go ahead and make my own version of a Megalodon. I'm gonna go for scaling, uh, maybe like 1.8. Yeah, nice, double lasers, that's what I'm talking about. Okay, weapons, let's put these little laser beams right here. Yeah, nice. Just gonna attach some pipes here just to make it look like it actually fits a little bit better. Oh yeah, yeah, that looks awesome. Uh, let's give him some glowy eyes as well. Whoa, nice. Laser Megalodon up against 15 skeletons. Let's see how they go. Oh, dude, what? Yes! Get blasted, champ! Okay, that looks really cool. Look at the sparklies coming out of his eyes and stuff. I like the look at this guy. Yeah, dude, burn them. Did you see that skeleton that he just picked up in his mouth and shook him around? Okay, this shark is amazing. Come on, zap him. Yes! <laughs> he looks amazing. Looks really, really cool. Let's try three of my laser megalodons up against a stack of soldiers who appear to be guarding some kind of ancient magical temple. Oh, what? In like about a second, they just zapped all of the soldiers dead. I didn't even buff their lasers. All right, let's try this again, but with a few more soldiers this time. Oh yeah, okay. The sharks got smashed this round. I think it comes down to who's able to attack first. What? He's biting the metal. Oh, they've got back up this time. Let's go Megalodon. Hang on. The fence is actually stopping them. There's no way the Megalodon can actually get in there and attack the soldier. There's only one soldier left. Oh, he's coming for you now, cheap. He's got you now. Oh, Megalodon has won. Okay, I figured somebody would ask for this, so I'm gonna make it before you actually ask, all right? Yes, I am making a fist meg. This is going on. Oh yeah, let's give this shark some fists. Can we actually, oh yeah, we can put him on there. Gains, gains. <laughs> this shark has been going to the gym every day, all day, every day. Let's go. Oh, he's so tough. I don't think he's too good at wearing sunglasses. Yeah, they don't really fit. An all-out fist fight is about to break out. We've got Fist Megalodon up against a stack of bold billies and the ogre giant guy. I can't remember his name. Hill Giant, that's his name. Oh my God, his arms are too heavy. <laughs> what? Oh, no way, bold billy got wrecked. Okay, come on, that's it. You need to fly, champ. You gotta punch. Use those gains on the hill giant. Oh my god, the fists are too big. They weigh too much. Come on, that's it, shark guy. Punch him. Punch him good. Is he still alive? He's doing pretty well. He's got half health. Okay, this is a fairly evenly matched battle if it wasn't for the fact that I gave all the humans too much health. Oh, he's hugging them. Oh yeah, come and get some. Let's go. Nice. Look at that biting power and the punching. Man, he's so good at the punching. There's so much blood pouring out of the shark's head at the moment. He is one tough dude though. He's getting in there with his fists. That's it, toss him around. Bite those dinosaurs in the heads. Doesn't matter how tiny they are, doesn't matter. It's Christmas time. Do whatever the heck you want, man. <laughs> he's doing really well. I love how he sort of shakes his head around. Oh God, he's got a dinosaur biting his eyeball. 
That's gotta hurt. Like, ah, my eyeballs! <laughs> yeah, get him, dude! Oh, he died! The dinosaurs got him! To test my next shark creation, I've got an ancient army here, mostly these horse dudes. I'm gonna call them greasy horse dudes. Going up against my latest shark creation, the warrior shark. He's got flaming shields on the sides there. He's got one of those things. I don't know what that is. It's like a double sword. He also has a shield, but he also has his mouth. Let's go, champs. Warrior sharks are coming in. They're biting all of the guys. Yep, there's like a stack of uh, ancient guys there. They're all dead. Most of them are dead. We've got the surfer dudes back here who look like they're actually fresh from the ocean as well. Firing their weird red needles at the sharks. But also, I think also hitting their own men. What? I'm already two sharks down. No way. How is that shark still going? Oh, he died. I think this team needs some laser megs. Oh yeah, that'll help them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, go laser megs! Get in there! Oh, that's the stuff. Yep, now I think they're doing pretty well. The laser megs are definitely helping. Look at that cool washing machine move they do. The shark fully just goes into spin cycle. Oh, that one's got a horse stuck in its neck. Ow! Oh, the surfer guys. You're about to die! Oh, what? They killed him! Got him with their arrows! They're stuck on each other! They're struggling! Come on, get him! Get him! He's dragging his shield across the ground. <laughs> it's a running race! <laughs> this guy, I think, actually has a broken knee. He can't bend his leg. Oh, you're stuck now. You're stuck now, champ. Yeah, he gotcha. Oh, oh, oh! Where are you gonna go? Where are you gonna go? Oh, the horse tripped him up! It freaks me out that these guys don't really have any eyes, so I'm, I'm just gonna give him some eyes. Oh, there we go. Whew! So much better. Yeah, now they can see what's, go what's going on. It's good. I might give them some eyebrows as well. We'll give them white eyebrows. How big can we make one of these sharks? Oh, we can make them super big. Whoa, that's a big shark. Oh yeah, that thing is huge. Dude. <laughs> he looks like he has a baby killer whale that he's taken care of. I don't even know if that shark's gonna be able to work. I think he's too big. Oh yeah, look at that. He just goes straight into the tree and bites the trees. Yep, this shark is too giant. He's just going out that way. He's like, nah, I'm way too big for this map, champ. This guy right here is the weirdest looking creation I've ever made. Probably. He is called the Killer Killer Whale. That's right. He's got missiles on the side of him. He's got lightning guns on the top. And I think I even, yeah, I did. I put a laser beam in his mouth. That's right. He has laser beams in his mouth. He's going up against Space Godzilla. Let's go. Oh, this is gonna be a good battle. Let's go, champs. Look at those missiles getting right in there. How's the health going? Oh, yeah. Killer, killer whale. He's actually winning. I think he's going to beat Space Godzilla. I think he's too tough for him. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah, killer, killer whale. <laughs> this is one I definitely won't be putting on the workshop. <laughs> he's got such a derpy look. If there's any units you guys want me to check out, let me know in the comments. And thank you very much for watching this video. I'll catch you guys next time.